the Sabres entered the league in 1970 with the first overall draft pick, the eventual linchpin to the fabled French connection. Greetings, everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro, you will see and hear in just a moment, and I'm Mike Emery. The Leafs up against the Buffalo Sabres. What stands out to you with this matchup? Well, how close it is between Toronto and Buffalo, Doc. 90 miles, 145 kilometers for our Canadian fans, but to me, that's what makes this rivalry so special. You have Maple Leaf fans in Buffalo country, and you have Sabre fans in Toronto country. Here we are in Buffalo, and looking down from my vantage point, I can't tell who's the home team. Maple Leaf fans have certainly backed up their support and loyalty for the visitors. And now we turn to the last lines of defense, the goalies. Hutton's the man in the crease for the Sabres. Frederick Anderson on the heels of the Jennings Trophy share with the Ducks' John Gibson. He came in a trade to Toronto, where he represents the Leafs' solid hope for the future. Face-off number one gets us underway. Eichel sent to the big center ice circle for Buffalo. Matthews gets the nod for Toronto. And who will get in the first big hit? Often that triggers thoughts of rivalry games past. Let's see. It's a stoppage and a startage now for Ray. It's always kind of cool when there's fans from the other side in the building. Lots come from Buffalo to Toronto or Toronto to Buffalo to support their team. Thanks very much, Ray. The Leafs win that neutral zone faceoff. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Pushing it on up the wing. A shot. Save! And decides to just hold on and get a stoppage of play. The Sabres win that faceoff. Fires a shot. Wonderful chance to score, but no. Tries to get it on net, right over the crossbar. On to Riley. Shoots one. A lightning light club. Big hit there. These two teams have that reputation. I'll bet some more are coming. The play is offside. Back to center ice. Buffalo's defense hasn't been perfect. They've given up some quality chances. But when you got a goalie behind you with a glove like that, he can bail you out at the perfect time. A tad over five minutes played here in the first. No goals to report yet. The Maple Leafs prevail on the draw. Corralled it again. With a shot. That one's deflected off the mark. That puck flopped over the glass and is out of play, and a fan from Corona, Ontario, came up with it. Nice face-off work. Directing that one to Reinhardt. Crosses that line. That is up close and personal. Well, there's no surprise there, Doc. We expected a physical game. The contest will be aggressive from start to finish. There's an early hit to set the tone. Let's it go. He scores! They'll certainly have more energy. They've got the game's first score, and now they can play from in front. That is the first goal scored after a lot of work. Great start. They were ready to play, and it shows on the shot clock as well. The Maple Leafs control from the neutral zone. 
Toronto's finding its way to center ice. Good shooting play. Puck ricocheted off the screen. Time of the goal, 8 minutes, 40 seconds. Slid to Skinner. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Turned away with the stick. Just a bit under nine minutes to go in period one. Only one goal hanging on the board so far. So it's one nothing. And now it's directed to Nylander. Intercepts that pass on the attack. Blocked. Gathered up again by Marlowe. And he shoots one. Good save there. Pass attempt to Middlestack. Driving in from no man's land. Biggest chance of the game. That shot came from just six inches. Now that's a solid save. Shoots one. Good work there in goal. Moved up the wing to Middlestack. It's all on his shoulders. Score! And the game is even. Well, I guess this game's not going to spread out. That goal ties it. The teams are so evenly matched. The Sabres control from the neutral side. Number 37, assisted by number 55. Smart recovery by Sherry. Shot! That shot came from nowhere. He had his eye on the puck the whole time. What a stop. Saved there. Handled with the stick. Puck controlled now by the defense. And he fires. He was standing in the lane and got some of it. Puck is thrown to Opozo. In the first period. The Maple Leafs see the clock getting down to the smaller numbers now, but still time to get it back up ice. Let's a shot go. One period played, a goal scored each. That's been it. Pretty tight fisted here after the first. Feeling hungry? Try our arena restaurant for gourmet dining. With great views of the action, we'll get a light meal at one of our many grill locations on the common. Middlestat's goal is the one that has tied this game. We are at the end of the period and headed to intermission. Contest is underway and all even up. Shoots one. What a terrific save. The Sabres get the draw. With a drive. At least he protected his goaltender. Cuts off that pass on the attack. Wonderful stop. Toronto's in their own end, carrying it off. Fantastic poke check. Oh, and it's off the mark. Good save. It's going to have to be something tougher than that to score. Breakaway. It's dangerous once you break a tie that you would sit back and try to protect the lead. I think you have to stay aggressive and play in the other end.
Buffalo's broken the tie and gotten back ahead, and we're still in the second period. Should be fun just to get to the end of this one. Toronto's got that neutral zone faceoff. And he shoots. Another shot wide. This game's not going to go on a highlight video. He's had chance after chance. He can't score. And they still trail. Grab that pass in the neutral zone. Good hustle to get back down the ice. No icing on this. Side to side they go, trying to generate something. Score! And this one is tied. Oh, that was a critical goal. Now the game is tied. And we'll see who can get the upper hand in the next few minutes. A little under seven minutes are gone here in the second. We are at two goals apiece. Maple Leaf score. scored by number 44. Gains the zone and looks over his options. By number two, Ron Hainsey. And by number 29, William Keeley. Time of the goal. Smart recovery by Skinner. Brought on and the forwards can change on this dump in. Pitching this one to Marner. And he hatchets one. And a save. Pitching it to Sherry. Takes that pass from the other point man. Just missed. Now that was an exciting moment. I thought he was going to score, but he just puts that puck wide from the slot. Could this be icing? And it will be, based on the defense arriving first. Hutton's ability to read the play made that a really easy stop off the odd man rush. Toronto's got a face-off win. Laid on to Kapanen. And he shoots. The Sabres are driving it from the wing. Look out, here it comes. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. Has a chance to make a play through the corner. With no time whatsoever, he turned it aside. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Say, propelled to Berglund. Buffalo's in the neutral zone along the wing. It's dumped in. Looking to Kapanen. And in flight over the line. Took care of that one. And decides to just cover it up and get the whistle. Pretty easy save for the goaltender as he just handles that. He handles about 100 of those in practice a day. Good face-off victory there. Oh, snaps the shot. Oh, what a great block. Passing one off now to Pominville. And he is shooting. That's a good save in goal. They're going to have to come up with something better than that. That shooter might want to check his stick. If that's all that he's got in the arsenal, it's not going to score very often. That's a solid face-off win. Shoot. Trying to go to Pominville. Buffalo's winging it at neutral ice. Moving it to Nylander. 
Let's it go. Guarded the goal again. Two periods are in the books here. And the books could very well have some perspiration stains on it by now because these teams have worked pretty hard. But still, a third period is ahead. Two period shots on goal totals read like this. 14 for the Sabres and 12 for the Maple Leafs. It's time for our hamburger banana. Riley's shot became his goal. Two minutes, it tied the game and we had to break. Courtesy of our arena. Test going into the third period, we're underway. That's a goaltender's best friend, a defenseman that can use a stick like that. Rister from the slot. He scores! Two straight goals. been a number of close chances here at either end as this continued tie game strung out. Now they've got the lead. We'll see where it takes us now. Toronto's broken the tie here in the third period. Let's see what happens before time expires. The Leafs got that faceoff win. Now what? Offside is called. Somebody got over anxious. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. Skates it into the zone. Oh, a save there. Faceoff win here. Sent it wide. Gathered up again by Skinner. Intercepts that pass. The Maple Leafs force another turnover in this game. Let's see what they can do with it. Snapping a pass to Ristolina. Pass cut. Toronto is setting up an offense from the wing. And he dumps it in. Directing that one to Reinhardt. Stick handling up the wing. Takes it in from the neutral zone. An enormous hit. Riley's not strictly a finesse player. He uses the body to his advantage quite frequently. And now it's directed to Hyman. He's in! Comes up big on the breakaway. Pass attempt to Opozo. He is shut right off. Solid hit directly right through the puck carrier. Excellent open ice hit. Good place to shoot from. Boy, he could have brought more to that one. Good save. The Sabres are skating it up at neutral ice. Enormous hit. He's crushed. This game is going to wind down and be close right to the final horn. Each team has tried to enforce their style of play on the other. It's just not happened. Takes that pass. On the outside, a shot. Bad save. Ooh, hard one there. Collected in the corner. Sends it down low now. Collected at the boards. Looking for options. Great save. He covers and has diffused the attack for now. Great pressure there, Doc. I thought for sure there was going to be a goal. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Just a little over six minutes still showing on the clock this period. The Maple Leafs lead by a goal. They just broke the tie moments ago. Hatchets one. That hits somebody. Toronto's in possession as they travel up the wing. Made that stop. A 
clutch win of the faceoff there. Routine save. The Sabres with a neutral zone possession along the way. Gets to the backhand and shoots. That shot hit a man. And he hammers one. Save. Berglund's cut through the neutral zone. A big collision in the middle of the ice. After that hit there, Doc, we better tighten up our chin straps. Made the save. Sabotka's injury was apparent as soon as you saw this hit. Huge collision, bone-rattling check. They won that faceoff. Can they clear it? The Sabres continuing on through center ice. Shoots one. Tremendous hit. We are in the last minute of regulation time. And he lets it go. That hit somebody. The Sabres go for broke. Their goalie is pulled. Trying to relieve some of the pressure. He got rid of it. That's the only play he had there, Doc, is to get it out of his own zone. Let's check in at ice level with Ray. Hainsey's laid the body on all over the place tonight. He's been like a one-man wrecking crew. That's good, Ray. I think he sure has his fans out there. Centermen practice this so many times at the end of their game day workouts. And here comes the biggest one, perhaps, of the whole season. Chip to Opozo. He's got that point pass. Turned a shot on net. Nice save there. They're going to have to do better than that to beat him. The cage is vacant. Chance taking time. So important to win the next face-off now. That's an enormous offensive face-off win. Loud pad save. Toronto's looking. Net open. He scores! That one should put the icing on the cake. That's a good feeling on the bench. You've locked it up now with the empty netter. The Sabres control at center ice. On to Sherry. Outstanding save with a glove. Goalie to the bench, extra attacker out. Does not get any more dramatic than this. Four feet by six. Yawning open at one end, hoping for an advantage at the other. And a save! The clock is at zeros. The game is over. Buffalo's defeat is marred a little bit. They thought they could tie the game by pulling the goaltender. Did not work out. Don't mind that they pulled the goaltender when they did, and those type of things are going to happen when you're trying to win the game. So the teams have left the ice and are getting rested for next time. For this time, for Eddie and Ray, Mike Emmerich saying good night.